our meeting, those who may have been slightly astray have seen that what was done was wrong and they have given assurance that going forward we will not be seeing such things happening. In this way, we can model good behavior uh, to approach all situations with humility, empathy, and dependence on God's guidance. And all have pledged that going forward, they will conduct themselves and proceed in this spirit. There have been press queries with regards to who the flag bearer for UCA in the presidential elections will be. All of the presidents, without accept exception, again yesterday reaffirmed that they were ready to serve under any of their colleagues that will be settled upon. All of the presidents, without exception, reaffirmed that position. As stated in our last presser, the issue of the process by which the presidential candidate shall be selected was tasked to a subcommittee of the Council of Presidents. The subcommittee asked one of its members to put together a proposal that will be presented to the Council of Presidents. That proposal has been put to together, but however, Council of Presidents has not yet sat because the Committee of Secretary Generals of the UCA parties stated that they felt they should have also an input as regards to the process. And quite naturally, seeing that we are an all-inclusive uh, party, and as I stated uh, towards the... What the late President Shiluba, when he attempted to do exactly what you are trying to do, there was, no, there was a third term, there was a third term, and the people were not hungry. The economy was doing extremely well. There was power, there was everything. There was dollars in the banks, and the people are moving freely. And the President Chiluva never, never unearthed the colonial legislation of seditious practices and espionage, which were used in the colonial days. But even without doing that, we still stopped him in his tracks. Yes. We shall fight. The people will fight. The country will fight. We shall not allow you to stay beyond 13th August 2026. Yeah. 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 Mr. President, you are personally not happy with certain clauses in the Constitution. And we know where uh, there are many which we urge you, if you really want, to come out clearly. And uh, coming out clearly is about negotiation. But <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much uh, for that question. Uh, the first thing I can tell you, fellow Zambians, is that uh, uh, I'm not incorrigible. Uh, I'm not incorrigible. This simply means that I can be corrected. And uh, for me, with this new team you see in Uka, it's an opportunity to correct the wrongs that happened under my watch when I was president. You, you see, she wasn't part of government. He wasn't part of government. All oh, these people on my left were not part of government. On my right, they're not part of government. So it is a different concept altogether. And I said it elsewhere, and I will say it again at the expense of monotony, that I'll have to learn from those who are criticizing us and I also have a chance to tell them, those who will be leading, that this is where we went wrong as PF. 
So I have the benefit of the old and the new. So I can tell you that the issue of cadarism is one of the items identified as needing immediate attention in the new government from 2026 onwards. And I think I was standing there to say, you can't do this because this is what brought PF down. Yeah, yeah. Yes. So, so uh, give me a chance to work with this team, and I can assure you that we'll be better. Beyond that, I can't, I can't promise anything more, but I can assure you that uh, all these people you see here mean well. And if I was to come back at the helm or as a member of the new team, I can always remind my friends that uh, this is how we lost it. And I think uh, I can even go further and tell you that the majority of the people who have inspired me to think of coming back are those who worked with UPND and supported HH. And they're telling me that uh, we told him not to do this, but look at him, he's doing it. And I told them, I said, the power there is very tempting. Man. <laughs> so, so you really need uh, to be alert all the time that uh, this is what we promised the people. And I, for one, can tell you that I know what brought us down. Apart from Qatarism, some of these things were happening because I thought everyone was with us on the same page in terms of influencing and affecting policy. But not all. But this time around, we'll do better. Unless you want, unless, unless you want more experiments, guys. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Thank you. Thank you.